What's up guys, Sharky Choshi here, back again with another Cricket Tune solo run. So I decided to cut this video into two parts, and uh, cause since the last video actually took a long time. So uh, yeah, we're gonna be facing the gym leader Grant, the rock gym leader. I do not know how many times we're gonna lose this battle. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a decent amount, but once we defeat him, this will be a huge accomplishment. So I'm gonna go ahead and save. Uh, first time I probably won't um, reset, but the second time when I save, I am gonna go in and reset it because um, I'm probably gonna be almost over leveled, and I really do not want that to happen. So this is why this this run is so hard. I'm using a very very unconventional Pokemon to face this guy. So let's go ahead and battle him. It's been a while. An eager. Uh, it's been a while. An eager. Uh, an, uh, it's been a while. An, a, an egg. Uh, whatever. <laughs> I can't read today for a worthy uh, challenger to appear. It's quite an achievement to have climbed all the way up here. Very impressive, actually. I have a feeling that our battle will turn out to be worth the wait. I hope that you will show me your skills as a trainer surpass as a trainer surpasses my even mine. Oh Jesus. Probably one of the toughest battles we're gonna have in this game. Grant the gym the rock gym leader. He's gonna send out his Auroras, which just straight up decimates our cricket tune. Oh, Oh my god, level 25? Can I go back? <laughs> We're not gonna do this. Actually, I did a decent amount of damage. T-Wave, nice! He's actually giving me a chance. Thank you for giving me a chance. Actually, this guy's giving me a chance. And before I get like 20 paralysis. This, 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 this. Okay, never mind. He's not giving me a chance. This is gonna hurt. Actually, no, it doesn't hurt. Nice. Okay, we took out his Auroras. Actually, this might not be that bad. The guy with the Relicanth was pretty, pretty, pretty freaking annoying. So this actually might not be that bad. Huh, cool. So he's gonna go ahead and send out his Tarantrum. And this is the Pokemon that I'm more scared of. This is the Pokemon I'm scared of the most. So he's gonna bite. He's not gonna use rock moves. I'm actually very happy with this. Um, with this outcome. I thought this was gonna be a lot harder. Huh, cool. So let's go ahead and heal up. Because um, I really do not want to deal with this, any of his shenanigans. Wait a minute. This, this, the guy with the Relicanth was harder than this guy. I lost to the guy with the Relicanth three times and I just ignored him. Okay, he's going to Rock Tomb now. <gasps> Holy. Uh... Please be faster. Please don't KO me. Okay, I spoke way too soon. <laughs> He's like, I heard you talking smack. I'm gonna go wreck you now. He's like, I'm, I was gonna go easy on you. And then I heard you talking all that good stuff. And then he decided to just... Okay, I'm gonna go in and kill you with a rock tomb. Uh, I really wish I didn't waste the Lumberry, because Lumberry would be a very, very, very good item for this situation. So, like I said, I'm the, I was not going to save the first time, because uh, I wanted to level up. I think I leveled up, actually. Um, did I? Let's go ahead and check Pokemon. No, I didn't. So, I didn't level up, but um, um, I want to level up at least once before I save again, and then I just reset for days. Actually, once I get to level 29, I'll start resetting. But um, <clears throat> I'm going to show the climb again. If you guys have not seen it or you guys have never played this game and you guys want to see how to climb this, uh, this is how you do it. Uh, the other times, I'm just going to jump cut to it. Oh, you don't want to go on there because there's a trainer up there. But um, I'm going to show you how it's done and the rest, I'm just going to jump cut to it. But holy moly, he, he heard me talking all that good stuff and he's just like, you know what? I don't like you talking all that smack. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, knock out your cricket tune. Looks like this is gonna be harder than I think. Um, hopefully, actually, it was. It wasn't that bad. I think if I get a little bit stronger, if I had a, like a life orb or something, I'll be able to defeat this guy relatively easy. So, um, talk to this guy one more time. 
and then hopefully we can knock him out this time. So, uh, let's do this, baby. Grant, the gym leader. You were challenged by leader Grant. Sends out, uh, or, I don't know how you say that name. <laughs> Okay, so my Krikatoon is going to come out, and I'm going to go ahead and Bug Bite, and hopefully this will do enough damage. Knock it out! Don't T-Wave! Why you gotta... Why you do this? Why you do this to me? Okay, I need to get rid of this Paralysis, because this Paralysis is, is going to be a huge detriment to me. Um, I only have one Paralyzed Heal. So let's go ahead and heal myself with the Paralyzation. If he, if he spams T-Wave again, I'm going to get really... Take down, okay. That should not... He's going to hurt himself by doing that. So, um... I'm going to go ahead and go for the Bug Bite. Since I'm not slowed anymore. Do a significant amount of damage to it. Knocking it out. Nice. Nice. Okay. Since I am level 27 now, this is very good for me. And actually, I forgot to save. I forgot to save. I should have saved. But, um... Anyway, let's go ahead and go into my bag and go heal up because uh, this guy might just shoot a rock type move to us. Hopefully he goes for a crunch or something. He, he probably is going to go for the killing blow with the rock type move. Yep, rock tomb. Holy jeebus. That does way too much damage. I just got to hope that crit, 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 please crit, no crit, uh, uh, crit. Uh, okay, this is going to be pretty hard. So, like I said, I'm going to go ahead and jump cut to it and then <laughs> battle him again. Uh, thank goodness I made this into a solo episode because this is going to take forever. It's going to take a long time. So, I'll see you guys once I jump cut right about now. Okay, guys, so we're back again, and, uh, let's fight this guy again. Third time's always the charm, am I right? Am I right? Smiley face, am I right? <laughs> we're gonna be here forever, I already know it. We're gonna be here forever. So, uh, we're gonna face Grant again, and hopefully he doesn't one-shot us. Ugh. It's not gonna be bueno. You know what's not going to be bueno? I'm going to knock out this Auroras. That's, why I'm, that's what's not going to be bueno for him. So let's go for a Bug Bite because uh, it looks like he just spams T-Wave from what I see. Um, yep, T-Wave is going off and it's going to put me to uh, get really slow. So I'm going to try something. I checked that I actually have an X defense. So let's gonna, I'm going to go ahead and use that. This is mostly for the... Um, Let's see how much damage it's going to do. Holy! Of course you crit me. Of course. Of course. <laughs> Please do that again. <laughs> we freaking lost this guy. Oh my god. And then he heals himself? I am done. This game is over. <laughs> Oh my goodness, for real, this is, you're going to be that way, right? You're going to be that way. So um, let's go ahead and uh, remove this paralyzation from me. And um, <clears throat> hopefully he goes for another takedown. No Critterino. Actually, I took that very well. Um, seeing, seeing how the uh, first one did 50%, this one did about 25%. If I had another X defense, I will use it at this, this time right now. But he's just going to go for a T-Wave, of course. Um, very standard for this, for this annoying Pokemon here. Um, I don't know if I should heal up or if I should use another Paralyzation Heal. Let's go ahead and use Paralyzation Heal <clears throat> to heal up. He's just going to go for a takedown. Holy moly, this stings way too much damage is... Let's go ahead and heal up. Oh, this is going to be a strategy, guys. We have to take this like, uh... We have to take this correctly. Rock... Okay, this guy is getting pissed off. Actually, I took that very well. Um, sadly enough, I am sl very slow now. Let's go ahead and knock this thing out. Uh, bug bites. 
Because I don't want it to be alive anymore. We actually took that rock tomb very well. Um, luckily enough. I really wish we can level up. So we can get some healing up. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and heal myself since I don't have to worry about paralyzations anymore. <clears throat> superhero. Superhero. Super heal is going to come out. Heal me all the way back up. <gasps> Cricketoon, please. Why you do this to me? <gasps> it's over 50%. <gasps> <I did not. gasps> please don't be faster than me. 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 <gasps> <gasps> we did it! <laughs> we did it! <laughs> Holy! We did it! We're we're gonna win it all. <laughs> Third time was the charm. <laughs> Holy moly! There are some things that seem out of reach, no matter how hard you try. Of course, I'm using cricket tune. However, it is important that you never give up. Of course, that applies to everything in life. Um, no matter the opponent or the odds. <laughs> you understand me like a buck. I couldn't tell from I could tell from our battle that you and your Pokemon understand that. The camaraderie, uh, such bleh, the camaraderie bleh, 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 English English the camaraderie whatever you know what I mean. Such an impressive show of teamwork. Please accept the cliff badge. The camaraderie. There we go. My English is going out the window. <laughs> I need to start reading a little bit more. <clears throat> Felix received the cliff badge from Grant. With the cliff, with the cliff badge in your grasp, you should have no issue in working together with your Pokemon up to level 40, which is now, now we are fine at this point. We don't have to worry about anything else. This was the hardest opponent we had to face, and we had to get here to level 30, and that's why we skipped every single trainer known to man, because uh, we would have been screwed if we didn't. This even applies to Pokemon that you received from others in trade, and that's not all. You get this. We obtained Rock Tomb. It's Rock Tomb. With this move, a Pokemon can hurdle rocks at the targets. And oh my goodness, why do you do this to me? Why do you do this to me? Computer, why do you do this to me? There we go. <laughs> Not only inflicting damage, but also lowering it, the target's speed and preventing it from moving. Now that you become a master uh, wall climber, and conquered this gym. It is time for you, though, to about about to. It's time for you, though, about a time for you through whatever. <laughs> about how to apply your skills in other areas. Think about it. You can improve yourself as well as your Pokemon that are always by your side. Or Pokemon, just one, not Pokemons. Uh, <clears throat> when you find the answer. That's when you will be able to truly smile. Well said, well said, Grant. I think we should take those words of wisdom and put a, imply them in real life. And if you guys are VGC players or watch my VGC content, apply that to real life. Uh, no matter how many times you lose, no matter how many times you win, just make sure that you learn something from it. And uh, you will apply that in everyday life. And, uh, you know, you'll get stronger and better. Um, that's what I always say. I rather lose more than I rather lose and learn than win and not learn at all. And uh, you guys should also apply that to life. But anyway, let's go ahead and heal up, and then go into the next town since we do have the uh, bike. We're gonna go to the next town, talk to Karina, and uh, go all the way to I think the Mirror Cave. I don't know what it's called, Mirror's Cave. I don't know what it's officially called but we're gonna go there and uh, we will probably stop the recording right now let's first of all pick up this lepa berry and fight this this trainer yeah so uh I feel good about that I think we can actually win this I think we can do it I, I truly believe we can do this guys this feels great I feel like I feel like I feel like 
I felt like I ran a marathon after that. It was freaking awesome. <laughs> no one can stop us. <laughs> We're too strong. <laughs> me and Cricket Tune will take over the world. <laughs> oh my goodness. Who's gonna summon? Done sparse? Get out of here. You will be destroyed. <laughs> oh my goodness. So, uh. He's gonna. My opponent's gonna send out the Zoomerol, and uh, my opponent is gonna go ahead and resist these attacks, sadly enough. As you guys can see there. Actually, he still did a lot of damage. When a Zoomerol has a lot of bulk and health, and it resists it. But, uh, shows you the power of Krikatoon. And at the same time, I am like mm, 10 levels up. Defense Curl? What are you trying to do? What are you trying to do there? Well, 9 levels up. Let's go ahead and uh, struggle bug this person. Do a decent amount of damage. And, uh, yeah. Oof. So delicious. Now I can face every trainer known to man and, and uh, level up very high up. Actually, yeah, I can level up all the way up. Um, I was like, actually, I still have to go through that cave. So, uh, I don't know for sure if I can actually level all the way up. So, here's another Team Flare member. Stop right there. I remember you. You were the one who foiled our fossil finding plans. And now you're here standing around these stones. Don't you have any idea what they are? Of course you don't. You know nothing about the legend, the legend of 3,000 years ago that say, wait, what does it say? Oh, whatever. Who cares? All ab who cares about that? Um, it is time for me to to get some sweet revenge. To get me <laughs> English, please. To get some sweet revenge with style. Oh yeah, looking fabulous. So we're gonna face Team Rocky Grunt. And he's gonna send out his Hound Dower. <laughs> we already defeated this thing once. <laughs> Oh my goodness, let's go ahead and defeat this thing and then get on our way. Level 21, you've been training. Too bad you can't defeat the, the ultimate Krikatoon. The great and powerful Krikatoon. <laughs> so go bats, ooh, you have been training. Look at that level. Let's go ahead and slash this thing. Let's see how much damage that will do. I did like literally zero damage. Oh! Oh, okay, it was a critical hit. Oh my god, did I just misclick and lose the game? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Phew! Phew! <laughs> but, uh, still, he's relying on hacks at this point. So I'm gonna go ahead and heal up, since I have a lot of these. And, uh, I should've just went for the bug bite in the begin with. It would've done more damage. Since it is a technician bug bite. Calm down! Trying to scare me there. Sadly enough, uh, me healing does not count as a turn of confusion. So I am going to hit myself. Uh, I still have several turns of confusions left. So um, hopefully I can break out of it this turn. Nope. Confusions literally... Are you really going to troll me like this game? Are you really going to You're gonna do this to me? Are you going to do this to me, game? Are you really going to do this to me? Oh, if you have few. Oh, this game. You're making me angry. <laughs> that was already three times in a row. This game does not want Cricket Toon to succeed whatsoever. If this game does not want Cricket Toon to succeed. If this is a fourth time. Thank you. I was about to like throw my DS across the room. <laughs> no, nah, I wouldn't. But um, that would have been pretty freaking annoying. So <sighs> that battle, though, <sighs> confuse Ray. Anything that has to do with confusion is such an annoying move, and uh, relying on it is just terrible. What? How can I lose again to a little punk like you? With that. What are you, some kind of trainer prodigy or something? Haha, <laughs> how did you know? I see. Roger that. Hey, 
Gotta lo gotta love the holocast to get uh, updates on my mission on to get updates on my mission in real time with stylish device with this stylish device. However, uh, these are up. However, though, these things must be one truly stylish invention too. And with that note, it is time for me to scram with style. So he's gonna go ahead and leave, and uh, I'm starting to read terribly because I am very uh, thirsty. And uh, I really don't want to get up to get to water because I am recording. Oh, a sigilif! Let's go ahead and knock it out. <laughs> Just for the heck of it. I want to see how much damage my cricket tune can do. Let's go ahead and knock this thing out so we can get to level 30. Oh, <laughs> whoa! That thing took it like a champ. Okay. And we're going to knock out the sigilif. Get out of here. We're going to level 30. We're, we're on our way to Vermilion City! <laughs> X Scissor. Sure, why not? Even though Bug Bite is still powerful. See, Bug Bite is 60 uh, power. X Scissor is uh, 80. With Technician Boost, it goes up to, I think, 85. And then with Stab, it goes up to at least 100. Actually, I don't know. <laughs> But I know it goes up to at least 90, 97, 95%. So uh, it's almost to 100. Um, that's why it's so powerful. Technician technician with uh, moves like that are just so powerful. Actually, no, it goes up to like 100. 100 and, let, me, let me go ahead and do the math, actually. Go ahead and do the math right now. This is going to be like very broken math because I, I forgot... The, uh, okay, bam, 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 it's about 110, 120, uh, base damage that you get with that, so, uh, that's why Bug Bite is so powerful on, uh, Cricket Tune, you get ability with Technician and Stab, and then if you have, a, like, a Life Orb or something, th that, this thing literally goes up to, like, 150 damage, 160 damage, so, uh, that's why you want to run Bug Bites on Cricket Tune because it's so powerful. So Krogan is going to come out. So we're going to go in and Bug Bite that thing too. Oh, it does 50% because it is uh, four times effect. Four, well, four times resisted because he is poison, poisonishness and a fightingishness. Bam. Yeah, it's about it's about a with us. It's about 120 or so uh, base damage. 110 base damage. I, I just did a rough calculation right now. Um, <clears throat> I'll probably will have it down below so you guys can know the actual the actual calculation. So let's fight this uh, another grunt. And uh, once we get to the city, we're actually going to go ahead and stop the video there. And then do, uh, do Mirror Cave all in one video. Oh, God, I got to stretch there. <laughs> Gotta stretch a little bit. I've been sitting here for a while. Actually, you actually you've been recording uh, three videos uh, before this, so hopefully you guys enjoy the other videos. I know in last video I did uh, stop abruptly, but um, that's because I wanted to uh, have this in another video because I, I realized that uh, the gym layer was probably going to take a while, and it did. It took half of this video. I think it took 17 minutes, and it's 25. As of recording, and I'm, I did a lot of skipping, so it's actually about 17, to about 15 minutes, and this video is actually about 22 minutes. So, um, yeah, <laughs> there you go. Um, once once I do all the editing and stuff like that, so let's go ahead and face this trainer, and then go into the town, heal up, and then uh, meet uh, Karina. And then we will stop the video from here. And uh, yeah, I'm glad that Solo Cricket Tune Run is back. It is freaking awesome. I wanted to uh, do this again. Like I said in my uh, my video that I came back with, um, the reason why I stopped recording is because um, you know uh, winter vacations did come up, and um, I didn't have enough time to actually record. And all this other good stuff. And then, um, Orest did come out. So, um, you know, 
a lot of stuff came out. <laughs> uh, Smash Brothers came out, Whereas came out. A lot of a lot of things came out. So um, they didn't really have time to do the Cricket Tune solo run. But now I'm back. If you guys want to see more solo runs with other very terrible Pokemon, or you want to see uh, Nuzlocke challenges or anything like that, please go ahead and tell me. Uh, I will gladly do it. These these are very fun. And uh, they allow me to talk to you guys, and you guys can ask me questions down below, and I can answer them during these little sessions, and we can have fun, and, you know, all this other good stuff. So, a uh, brown hippopotas. Nice. I think the females are brown, and the males are um, light brown, or grayish. I think that's how it works. But anyway, we're going to one-shot this thing. Ooh, just an almost to level 31. But I think we're going to stop fighting trainers here until Glitter Cave. And then, um, oh my goodness, how many Pokemon do you have? How many garbage Pokemon do you have? <laughs> Actually, Pachirisu is... We have to heal up because Pachirisu is a threat. Pachirisu is the strongest Pokemon known to man, if you guys don't know. Ugh. Look, oh my god, I think we just lost... Oh, okay, we know... It, it, it gave us it gave us a little scare there, but uh, Krikatoon is too OP. <laughs> if you guys don't know, uh, Krikatoon actually in the 2014 World Championships, the VGC World Championships, uh, Krikatoon actually uh, well Krikatoon <laughs> well Krikatoon's gonna win the World Championships someday, but uh, Pachirisu ended up winning the World Championships in the 2014 VGC World Championships. Ended up winning, and uh, yeah, it's a very scary Pokemon. You don't want to mess with it. <laughs> Hopefully, um, you, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, just Google 2014 World Championships, uh, VGC 2014 World Championships, um, and I think it's VGC 2014 World Championships, and you should get it. And then put finals, so you, because it is the final match. Oh, I, I like it when it does this. You know, when it zooms into uh, the professor, when professor, when it zooms into Nurse Joy, or it zooms out, or it does like a little curve. I don't know how you do that. I think it just randomly does it, but it's it's pretty freaking cool. You get you know different angles of the of how the you know the world looks. You know, it would be really cool uh, a first person view. You know, you know just just to make some like cool videos. You know, like machinima machinima like videos. Um, of course, you probably won't be playing it like that, but it'll be cool to have to do, like, Machinima-like videos. But, um, you know, whatever. Uh, Geosedge Town is a town of stones. I can't sing that, and I won't sing that. <laughs> okay, so there's no point of following that guy, because that guy goes over here, and he disappears forever. So, um, we're gonna go over here. Talk to this person. Construction? Actually, no, we have to follow that guy. I forgot. Because he goes into that cave thingamadoobopper. There we go. Once he goes in there. Um, once he goes in there, we can't follow him anymore. And I think these people over here leave. Uh, yes, that was someone from Team Flare. And, um, and that's it for this episode. Let's go ahead and uh, go over here. Karina is going to come out. No, I don't want to meet no players. Get out of here. <laughs> hey, you there. The trainer from uh, Route 5. Blech. I'm not exactly sure, but I think Lucario is saying it wants to battle with you. Will you battle with us? So, I have two Lucarios. But do you... But, blech, but do you know which one uh, has taken a shine to you? Yes, the one to your left. So we're going to face Corina. One of the three times you face Corina. So Lucario is going to come out, and the great and powerful Krikatoon is going to come out. Oh yeah, we, we got this, baby. We got this. Come on, Krikatoon. Destroy Lucario. Oh, uh... On second thought, I think I'll go that way. I think I'll run away. Let's see if this will do some damage. That did like this. Uh. Um. Uh. uh <laughs> Holy moly. I forgot this thing like four time resists it too. 
because it is a steel and a fighting type. So four time resistance, ness, ness, ness. Why do I say that? It's becoming a little thing. Oh my. This thing is plus three. If I lose to Corina, I'm just going to end the video now. Please crit, 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 crit. <gasps> oh. Oh, I got scared there. Oh, special defense harshly fell. That doesn't matter because you are a physical attacker. So, holy. At least we knocked this one thing. At least we knocked this Lucario out. So, um, we're fine with that. Oh, yeah, them points, baby. So, the other Lucario is going to come out and, uh, let's go and bug bite this thing too. Please give me a crit or something. Holy. No, uh, <laughs> I think we lost. I think. We <laughs> oh my goodness! Please stop. Why you do this to me? <laughs> Please stop. <laughs> uh, uh. <laughs> How do you have potions? <laughs> I forgot <laughs> they're four times resistant. I need power up punch so bad. This faint is like gonna one shot me. Actually, no, that actually didn't didn't do that much damage. Oh, huh, that's cool. So let's go in and go for a bug bite. It is gonna faint again because it is a priority move. It is plus two priority. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, do some damage to Lucario. It's going to heal up. Hopefully he doesn't. Hopefully uh, this Lucario doesn't crit me. Faint. Holy, uh, I really wish I had better potions than, I can actually defeat Karina if I had better potions, but I don't. If I lose to Karina this, uh, this battle, it doesn't matter, I'll do it next, uh, video, since I know what to do. <laughs> okay, um, this game is over. I can't, if I heal again, it doesn't matter. Because she's just going to spam faint over and over and over again. So I'm just going to go ahead and let myself get knocked out. And, uh, yeah. I blacked out and gave her some money. Now you rich. <laughs> but anyway, guys. This is a very long video. And I really do hope you guys are enjoying the Cricket Tune Solo Run. If you guys are not, I am sorry. Because, uh, I know it is very tedious to use a Cricket Tune. <laughs> But uh, I really do love Cricket Tune. It's just a well-designed Pokemon. But I mean, what I mean by well-designed, I mean it's god awful. It is terrible, <laughs> and it's hilarious. Look at this thing. It's so bad. <laughs> it is literally the worst fully evolved Pokemon in the game. Please, please Nintendo, please uh, Pokemon Company, give this thing like a Mega Evolution, or give it like a third evolution, or give it like a fourth. Make this thing a legendary, please, or something. Please, please, it's so cool. But anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And until next time, guys, I'll see you guys later with more Cricketune Solo Run. Bye, guys.